everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be an empties. So let's get cracking. Now, some of the products aren't actually empty, but they're old and they need to be gone and some of them I'm just not loving, so, but they're not that you could pass on to someone. So the first thing in here is this Soap and Glory Speed Plump Miracle Moisture Mask. And you will no doubt have seen me use the masks on Face Mask Friday, so I won't babble on about it. Uh, I think it was okay, as I say. I'll leave a link to the videos. I should really create a playlist, shouldn't I, for my Face Mask Fridays. But if you go through my channel, because of course you're subscribed, aren't you? And if you're not, then you should. So, we've used that. It's so sticky. I put something in this bag. Oh, yes. I put it in here because it's so sticky. Another mask, and I really, really loved this mask. I got this in my, oh, it smells so good. I got this in my American box swap from the lovely Senia. She has a YouTube channel, and yes, I enjoyed using that. And I'll maybe just pop it back in the bag. More face masks. Uh, this mask, a uh, little gold eye mask thing, uh, my friend Emily used in our face mask Friday where she was a special guest so again you can find that on my channel and she really enjoyed those she said they work really well thought they'd be a really good idea to put on before you have a night out or something and then there was this mask as well that's the big card for those everything's all slimy and uh, gross i'm gonna have to get another bag to put my in again another mask and it's all absolutely manky, but I actually think this one was nice. The rose mask from Body Shop. Ugh, everything's gunky. Oh my god. I need a tissue. But in the daydream. I'm getting guy of strawberry so on your love. I'm loving that song. When the night falls. Okay, so I, oh, I have finished two of these bad boys. I love this product so much. I love Pear Seam Read. So I have got this little 30 mils here. I think this was the one from... I got one from lovely Jill who has a channel, Drop Dead Fred. Please check her out. She's stunning. Love her to bits subscribe to her channel so i one is from her and one this one from anyway she did send me one and i've used up both of these so this one is the 30 mils some people don't like this smell but i freaking love it i actually have this on my hair just now i put it on last night i haven't washed it out yet and my hair's all static and all that jazz but i've been so busy fannying about and then this other one which i freaking love oh oh there's a tiny bit in there let me just, I'm going to pop on my hair. I love it. I just love the smell. I love how it makes my hair feel. I actually might be a saddle and keep these at the minute and cut them open, see if I can get any more products out. I do have a big version of it. And I also have another of, I think, this size. But yeah, they're empty. Oh, everything's so minky. Ew. Okay. Oh. Yuck, I literally have to wipe everything. Right, if you've been with me for a long time, or if you haven't, I'm shit at doing liner, particularly winged liner and line, just liner in general. But I'm all really, really, I'm really, really crap with liners. So this is all dried out and it's shit anyway, but this is a makeup, a... Makeup Academy MUA Winged Wonder Liner and I got it free with buying something else and it's crap. This was a good mascara but because I had um, that whatever eye reaction, I don't know if it was mascara or what have you, the mascaras that I've got open apart from my Bad Girl Bang, I am getting rid of them all because I've got other mascaras to use. So this is a Clinique High Impact Mascara so that's done and dusted. I have finished this perfume. Oh, God. Everything is slimy. 
It's from these face masks. I think once I've used the face mask, because I do face mask Friday, I really don't need to keep them. So this is Victor and Rolf Flower Balm. This is the original one. Smells lovely. Would highly get this again. Will I get any out at all? No, completely done. Perfume is never cheap, as you probably know. But yes, I love this. It's a beautiful bottle. But it's kaput. I finally finished my MAC Fix Plus. So this is the normal 100 mils. And yeah, it's okay. Nothing to write home about. I did not like this Elemis Superfood Facial Wash. I didn't like the smell. I don't really think it did anything for me. So I wouldn't get this again, but that's finished. I'm getting rid of this Colourpop a fine concealer. It's too drying. I don't like it. And the colour, as you can see, is completely wrong for me. So that's going. I am getting rid of this compact foundation. This is the Mineral Wear Talc Free All-in-One Cushion Foundation Broad Spectrum SPF 50 Sunscreen by Physicians Formula. And I just never use it. And it's just, it's just, yeah. I'm not really that enthralled. So that's going as well. I, I've had this for way too long. So this is why I'm getting rid of it. As you can see, there's still loads in it, but I've just had it for way too long and I don't really ever reach for it. It is a nice enough foundation. I personally don't think Rimmel ever lasts on the skin, but maybe that's just me. So yeah, it's going. And then we have this mascara is crap. I do not like it at all. It is the L'Oreal Ultimate Mascara that's got the bendy wand. Would never buy that again. Love this mascara. This is the Bobbi Brown Smoky Eye Mascara. And again, it's just been open for quite a bit of time. I love the brush. I have another one. So that can go. I have these little cucumber eye patches that I got in my box swab from Drop Dead Fred. Loved these. They were really cooling on my eyes. Enjoyed using them. So they're done. Deodorant, Sanex deodorants, I really like these roll-ons, but I don't think they last that long. Not at, um, as in to protect you, but like the product itself, it just never lasts long. I don't know why I'm doing the action. And then the last two minky things in this bag is this Wet n Wild Mega Wear Mascara. I quite like this, though it did transfer onto my skin on my bottom lashes, but again, I've had it for quite a bit and it's starting to dry out. And then I have a perfume sample of one of my favourite perfumes, which is the Black Opium Audio Perfume from YSL. So that's all my empties. So I'm going to put that back in there. Put that there, because that's to go to the recycling bin. <sighs> Should I open these? Oh, no. I'll be fine. So guys, that's me for my empties. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, click the bell button, subscribe to my channel. Still running my thousand subscriber giveaway. I've literally got a pot sat with everybody who's entered its name. Written, all folded, all shuffled, all ready to be picked and people to add um, as they come along. Now, again, if you want to enter the thousand subscriber giveaway, you need to go on to that video. I'll leave a link to it up above. Um, but it's not just a case of subscribing to my channel and you're automatically entered. So I will put a link to the video. But come on, it's a great, great prize. It's not one, not two, it's three Zoeva eyeshadow palettes and they're absolutely stunning and I cannot wait to pick one of you lovely, lovely people to win it. Currently, I think I'm at 953 subscribers, so we're getting there very, very slowly. But I'm every confidence that we can do it. It's a lovely little community over here. I've made such good friends. I have had such good support from people that aren't even, their subscribers, but they don't have YouTube. And we chat back and forward, and I just love it. And yeah, I'm really grateful for having you all. So let's expand the family. Come on over. 
Okay guys, I'm out of here. Take care.